In America, every aspect of cybercrime involves both attacking someone's equipment to make it malfunction or not function properly, as well as attacking someone's social media that offers people like you and me the opportunity to speak our mind, share our thoughts, and engage in community discussion. When people interfere with the access to those opportunities, in other words, those technologies, what we're doing is saying that that person's life force isn't worth anything to God. And that's just not true. The plain truth is that American citizens have stopped listening to the Lord's house. And the real truth is that siblings in an American city have often abused someone without their consent, and that is a pity.